Hey guys, what's going on? It's me, your boy Samson Biggs, and I'm here with another video. In this video, we're going to talk about how to get started. If you're overweight, you're out of shape, you can't do a push-up, you can't do a sit-up, You when you walk around, you get tired, okay? You're always hungry, okay? You haven't worked out and forever who knows it's january you decided hey i want to get back in shape well how do you get started how do you get started what's the plan what do you do okay it's real simple guys the first and most important thing is making that conscious choice in your mind that you want to change and you want to improve you want to do you want to be fit maybe you don't want to be fully fit but maybe you want to just be a little bit more healthier whatever but the key is to make that conscious choice and to decide then once you've made that decision you got to go after it now here's the thing that a lot of people will tell you and a lot of trainers will push you too hard i've had a lot of clients and when I first was a young trainer, I thought, oh, all right, let's get started. Let's get this, 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 get this going. Let's get you pump, pumped up. And I'd take people through a workout, and it would be just too intense, too much, and they would quit. So now what I do is we go into it really slow, super slow, okay? That's the way you got to be. You can't go into this full force. You don't have the, the fitness capability for that yet. So take it slow, okay? Take it slow. Try just doing a 10-minute workout. One day, 10-minute workout. The next day, 10-minute workout. Do that for the first week, you're just doing 10 minute workout. Maybe you're just walking. I'm gonna go for a walk for 10 minutes every day this week. Boom, that's your start. Week one, you've, you've walked for 10 minutes every day. Now you can pick it up a little bit. You say, hey, since I walked for 10 minutes every day last week, I'm gonna walk for 20 minutes every day this week. Okay, and then this each week, add 10 minutes to your walk. And then once you've done that, Maybe start adding some calisthenics. If you're big and heavy and you can't do a push-up, maybe you just get on your hands and do a plank for one minute. Not even one minute, 30 seconds. Not even 30 seconds, 10 seconds. If you can hold yourself up on your hands for 10 seconds on day one, that's a start. The next day, come back, try to hold yourself up for 10 seconds again. Do that for a week. Gradually, you start building up to these things. Don't think that you're going to just go and you're going to start doing pull-ups and push-ups and jogging and running miles and all this other stuff because you're, you're going to lose interest. You're going to lose faith. You're going to lose heart. Unless, you, you know, unless you're the type of person that says, no, I'm going 100%. Boom. Then that's okay. But you're going to be sore. <laughs> So the biggest thing is you can take baby steps. That's what I call it. That's what I tell my clients all the time. Take baby steps. If you can only do, you know, hold yourself up for 10 seconds, just do that. Do that every day for a week. Do that every day for two weeks. Do that every day for a month. Simple, simple little thing, you know. You don't have to go and, and be super fitness star in the beginning. It's going to take a while to get there. Even me, I do the same thing. Like, if I don't do pull-ups for a long time, I'm so heavy that I will lose the ability to do pull-ups. So, when I'm ready to start doing pull-ups again, I come back. I'll do one pull-up. That's it. The next day, I'll do one pull-up. That's it. First week, just one pull-up. Second week, then two pull-ups. Third week, three pull-ups. And just like that, take it slow, steady, baby steps okay you don't have to bust your ass crazy 
okay? It's your boy, Samson Biggs, and we'll be sending you all kinds of different uh, advice for fitness, all kinds of different tips to help you on your journey. If you are getting into fitness, let me know. Leave little comments, and I can help you out on your fitness journey. And, uh, yeah, make sure you subscribe to the channel, and we'll be back with more videos shortly. Good luck on your fitness journey.